Good day everyone. Today we will answer this algebra challenge and the question goes like this. Given the equation x raised to x equals square root of square root of 2 over 2, then if x is equivalent to a over b wherein a and b are both integers, then what is the value of a plus b? You can pause this video if you want to give this problem a try. Now, let's answer this question together. So given this equation x raised to x equals square root of square root of 2 over 2, and we know that x can be written as a over b, wherein a and b are both integers, then we want the value of a plus b. So first thing to do is we need to simplify the right hand side to make it equivalent to a number raised to the same number. So now, take note that square root of 2 is just 2 raised to 1 half. And the exponent of 2 on the denominator is just 1. Now recall that it says that if we have b raised to n over b raised to m, it is equivalent to b raised to n minus m. This is one of the law of exponent. Therefore, the expression inside the radical sign is equivalent to square root of 2 raised to 1 half minus 1. Now, 1 half minus 1 is just negative 1 half. And now, take note that square root of 2 raised to 1 half is the same thing as 2 raised to 1 half raised to 1 half. And also recall that if we have b raised to n, raised to the power of m, it is equivalent to b raised to n times m, or the product of n and m. Therefore, the right-hand side can be written as 2 raised to negative 1 half times 1 half. And negative 1 half times 1 half is just negative 1 fourth. Now, again, recall this negative exponent. If we have a over b raised to negative n, it is equivalent to b over a raised to positive n. So what we need to do here to make it positive is just take the reciprocal of the base. Take note that our base is 2 over 1. So the right hand side is equivalent to 1 half raised to positive 1 fourth. Now, here's the trick to answer this question. What we're going to do is to multiply this 1 fourth by 1 or simply 4 over 4. This is just 1. Now let's multiply the denominator but we are not going to multiply the numerator 4. So this will give us 4 times 1 over 16. Now using again this law of exponent b raised to n raised to the power of m it is equivalent to b raised to n times m. We will do backwards. So we have now b raised to n times m Therefore, it can be written as b raised to n raised to the power of m. Therefore, the right-hand side can be written as 1 half raised to 4 raised to 1 over 16. Now, 1 half raised to the fourth power is the same thing as 1 half times 1 half times 1 half times 1 half, 4 times. And if we simplify 1 half raised to the fourth power, this will give us 1 over 16. Therefore, the right-hand side is equivalent to 1 over 16 raised to 1 over 16. And on the left-hand side, we have x raised to x. Therefore, we can say that x is equivalent to 1 over 16. And now, take note that a can be written as a over b, wherein a and b are both integers. Therefore, we can say that a equals 1 and b equals 16. And take note that we want the sum of a and b. Therefore, the sum of a and b must be equal to 1 plus 16 or simply 17. Therefore, given that x raised to x equals square root of square root of 2 over 2, wherein x can be written as a over b, wherein a and b are both integers, then the value of a plus b must be equal to 17 because we know x is 1 over 16 and as always
we are done.